everyone, welcome or welcome back. I'm Melanie Kate Love and today I am just going for a walk on the beach as a part of my four ways to kickstart my day. And I'm noticing that when I am coming to the beach, which is where I feel truly in alignment, check this out, I get so many video ideas. So this is kind of um, impromptu, but obviously this is something that we need to talk about. So on the weekend, um, it was Peter's birthday. If you don't know, you're new to my channel, that's my wonderful partner who I manifested. So please check out the video, How to Manifest a Vegan Partner. And actually, before I go on, I actually received an email from um, one of my viewers who said she watched the video back in April and has now manifested the man of her dreams thanks to my video. So, woohoo, how exciting. Um, anyway, so when I was at um, Peter's birthday then was meeting all his friends and we got to talking by the way all of his friends are like entrepreneurs and in tune with their health and wellness and it was like amazing um, I got to chatting to um, a couple of girls and we started talking about experiences that are mirrored to us like people in our lives are mirroring things to us and it really got me thinking about um, <laughs> A couple of weeks ago, um, Peter was fundraising um, at a sausage sizzle. He had vegan sausages from Tofurky. Um, and this lovely gentleman came up and he was like, Ugh, what's this? Like, he's obviously never tasted a vegan sausage before. And he really upset me by the comments that he said. And it got my back up. For a number of reasons number one he was condescending in the way that he spoke to me which I don't deal with and that has triggered things from my past which we won't speak about um, I'm just gonna walk up this hill and the other thing was just his attitude to not being open-minded which in turn pissed me off and I'm usually a person where I don't speak up for myself I have a real tough time of defending myself I just go into um, like I get very withdrawn and I don't know I just kind of retreat and I'm not very good with comebacks or anything like that um, I'm just gonna climb up these rocks here and then maybe sit at the end see what the lighting's like this could be interesting um, yeah so yeah he was just horrible and it was like the first time that I actually started to speak up for myself and he was like saying oh yeah the bloody plant foods is like hippie foods and oh you're gonna die of something you know blah 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 you know just one of those real arrogant I'm just trying to work out how I'm gonna get up here just one of those real arrogant narrow-minded ways of thinking and then because it pissed hold on I'm just climbing Behind the scenes of Melanie Kate Love. Oh, it's beautiful up here. And because it like, I'm getting hot now. And ow. And because it really, really annoyed me, I was like, what is this mirroring to me? I'm just gonna sit right down the end. And then I'm guessing like my reaction. Oh, there's a surface towel there. I'll sit over here. Like my reaction to this dude is like is a reflection of me you know like it's got nothing to do with him how I reacted and essentially like when I was talking to these girls it got me thinking about like there are people in your life that mirror things to you like when I first got together with Peter which was like over six months ago now how exciting he um, was like he was so nice to me and I was like, oh, like, why does he want to spend time with me? Like, why is he being so nice? And why is he buying me flowers? And like, why does he tell me I'm beautiful? Because I've never had that. So there's going to be situations in your life on a daily basis that are mirrored to you. And just know that what is coming up, the way you react is a reflection of you and not that other person. You could have someone screaming at you, but that doesn't mean that you need to scream back, you know? If you hold back and you just stay poised and you're like, okay, I'll talk to you when you've got your manners or that's what I used to say to my kids when I used to teach. 
Um, but just know that whatever is coming up is the universe's way of bringing something to your attention that you probably didn't realize that you had going on for you. Anyway, so this is Words of Wisdom with Melanie Kate Love at the beach. It's funny how things just come up to you when you're not like trying to think of something. Like I've always struggled with, oh, how do I think of a video idea? And oh, it's Monday, so I've got to get this set right and I've got to make sure it's good lighting. And I'm just like, why do I need to complicate it? Life shouldn't be so complicated. You know, we just need to just go with the flow and be in tune with what's going around us. It is so bright here. Dude, so beautiful. Um. Yeah, so I hope this is something that you can apply to your journey and that whatever is mirrored to you, then that's something that you need to work on. And I need to get better at dealing with people that are um, condescending. And like, I did speak up for myself a little bit, but there's probably more that I could have said, or maybe I just should have walked away instead of just taking it. Anyways, my loves, I thought I just wanted to share with you um, what has been going on. <laughs> and I'm sure there'll be more little tokens of wisdom that's going to be coming up because I'm doing the four ways to kickstart your um, your day this week and I'm going to like talk back to you next week and give you like a weekly update and let you know um, how things are progressing and has things changed since I've done that. I was really hoping to get out into the sun today but it's very overcast so that's really not something that's happening today but you know what we just do the best we can and yeah just make better choices with each and every day. Anyways, my loves, I hope you're having an amazing day. Oh, before I go, I just wanted to mention that today is the first day that um, I can actually respond to um, my video, my goodbye video, because the other videos that you saw last week, so you've seen, you saw three from the previous week and then one from Tuesday, so this is kind of like a Wednesday's video, I'm assuming. <laughs> um, so those videos had already been pre-recorded. So that's why I wasn't able to say thank you. Thank you so much for your support that you guys have given me. And that response video is almost up to 4,000 views, which is absolutely amazing. And I'm gonna continue bringing videos to you because I really don't care about um, numbers. I'm trying to get away from the numbers game because it's just messes with your head. And I just want you to know that I'm making videos for each and every one of you that continue to support my channel, regardless if it's like a fitness one, a self-love, a meditation, or oh, the meditation's coming on Friday, I'm so excited. I actually did record a meditation video last week and I was gonna post it Friday to make the four videos last week, but I wasn't happy with it. I know I'm trying to be like going with the flow and just upload what comes to you, but I wanted it to, I haven't found the right music because I work with an amazing artist called Bevan um, he's from SoundCloud. I link him whenever I play his music in my videos. And it's just been so easy to, um, to just like put them in my vlogs because it's just my kind of vibe. But I haven't found a music producer that I like for my meditation vibe. So if I can't find one, then I will just take you to the beach or to like my meditation spot. I have lots of meditation spots at the moment, but yeah. But anyways, that's what's been going on for me. So just work on what is mirrored to you because that is a reflection of you and not somebody else. That's so important. Go with the flow of life, up your self-love practices because that is gonna keep you in alignment. And keep watching um, Tuesday's video about the four ways to kickstart your life or your life. <laughs> well, yeah, kind of like the new life, your new day. It's a new dawn, it's a new day. Do you want to see behind me? This is why I live on the Gold Coast. It is amazing. Um, I think that's everything. We're going to about nine minutes twenty-five right now, so I think that's kind of enough. Anyways, I will back. I'll be back tomorrow. I haven't worked out what I'm filming. I'll see what the universe brings up for me. I think I'm going to talk about my new jeans that I have. <laughs> which is so exciting. Can you see? Can't really see them. I would talk more about them. Actually, I'll do that tomorrow. Um, just so exciting. But if you've been following me on Snapchat, you're already up to date. So, oh, make sure you follow me on Snapchat. Snapchat. 
um, at MK Love Official. I wasn't able to secure Melanie Kate Love on Snapchat, but that's okay. I really like that name, MK Love Official. And what else is there? I'm on Twitter now. I'm trying to post daily affirmations to, you know, make you feel good about yourself. Yeah. It's going to be an amazing week, my loves. I can feel it. Have an amazing day. And I will see you tomorrow. How exciting. More videos from Melanie Kate Love. I love you so much, guys. And I will see you tomorrow. Bye. Today, I have five tips to help kickstart your day. And this is something that I have been trialing over the last week. And I'm feeling absolutely amazing. So I thought I'd share with you.